Hello, my name is Ken Pachenik with LED Lighting Incorporated. For this session, we're going to learn how to connect multiple pieces of RGB tape or the color changing tape together. The recommendation is that we use one 72 watt power supply, as you see uh, on the table here, to each 16.4 foot section. If you wish to connect, uh, if you have an application that requires more than a 16.4 foot section, you then need what's called an RGB amplifier, as shown here on the table. It's very important to note that the RGB amplifier has, has several connections on it. There's an input, an output, a DC 12 volt, and then each, each connection for the positive, the red, the green, and the blue is marked by R, G, and B. Uh, concept is that the power supply runs into the controller, the small white box, and then it goes into the first 16.4 foot run of tape. If you wish to, to continue and keep the same signal and the same colors passing through more than one reel of tape, you then go through the amplifier, which is again connected to a 72 watt power supply. So again, just, just to summarize, if you have two reels of tape, you'll need one controller, one RGB amplifier, and two 72 watt power supplies. I'll turn this on just, uh, just to show you. Right now we have blue color running in the first section, and of course the RGB amplifier then passes that blue color to the second section of tape. We would change it to a green, for example, it goes through as green, and you can change it to red, and it goes through as red, or in the color changing mode, it'll go through. So all the signals that are coming off the first reel of tape go through the amplifier and are passed to the second section. Uh, we also have what's called an RF uh, RGB controller. This is, this is unaffected. Uh, we would still use the same amplifiers, but this one uses, instead of an infrared, which is what you see here, it uses an RF control. Very similar concept. Uh, the only thing I want to point out here is that this is a hard wire, and the, uh, the input of this particular RF controller has a brown wire and a blue wire. The brown wire is the positive for, for plus 12 volts. The blue wire is the negative for minus 12 volts from your 72 watt power supply. And the output also is, is color coded. And I'll point this out. The black wire is your, is your plus 12. Uh, that goes to the tape. The uh, wire that's green and yellow is actually the green color. The brown wire is red and the blue wire is blue. So these need to be properly matched to the tape when you're putting them on.